For the last decade, the scientists and engineers at CELA have worked towards a singular goal. Our mission at CELA is really to power the world's transition to clean energy. And this is the beginning of that coming to fruition. Now, CELA co-founder and CEO Gene Bertaszewski says the company has reached a major development in that bold endeavor. We're announcing the global availability of our next generation nano composite silicon material called Titan Silicon. CELA's breakthrough anode material called Titan Silicon is now commercially available for automakers to power their electric fleets. We've hit a critical milestone on the product where we've optimized the processing in order to scale it for auto volumes. And we're in the process of buying all of that equipment for the factory we announced last year in Moses Lake, Washington. Titan Silicon, a black powder-like anode material, replaces graphite in the lithium-ion batteries that power electric cars. In doing so, Bertaszewski says the next-gen technology dramatically boosts the performance of those batteries. Today, Titan Silicon is able to deliver a 20% increase in range of an electric vehicle, uh, and we're able to bring the recharge time down to as low as 20 minutes. What we see is we'll be able to deliver more like a 40% increase in range over time, uh, well over 100 miles additional, and bring the charge times, we think, below 10 minutes, which is about how long you spend at a gas station. More distance with less charge time is a key focal point for customers surveyed in a new report released by CELA. That's actually the number one consideration when buying an electric vehicle. The quality of the battery, the range they're going to get out of it, and how long it'll last. Bertaszewski says developing Titan Silicon and optimizing it for scale was a long and rigorous journey. There's no shortcuts. We've spent over a decade in, in the labs. We've gone through over 70,000 iterations of this material, researching different recipes, different configurations, different formulations, uh, how to build it into different types of cells, and ultimately it landed on some recipes that worked that worked really, really well. Bertaszewski says the result is a product that delivers on the needs of customers and car makers with market-proven technology that is already in Whoop wearables and by the middle of the decade will power Mercedes-Benz electric vehicles. Car makers have to look out into the future. And one of the things that's happening is consumer expectations are going up. The, what they expect in range and performance and recharge time uh, it has to get better. And for the car makers that are looking to stay on the leading edge, they should be, they should be using this technology uh, or they will end up being left behind. Titan Silicon, driving the car industry towards an electrified future.